Modern historians consider Hurricane Katrina to be one of the most destructive natural disasters, but it might not have been. According to meteorologists, Hurricane Katrina was a Category 5, but only a Category 3 when it hit land. Most theoretical historians blame the military for this. The military knew the levees, which stopped the water from getting into New Orleans, were weak and unstable, but they never did anything to fix it. As you can see here, there are many ways the weak levees could have failed, as they did when Katrina hit. If the military would have fixed the levees, New Orleans would look like this, causing at worst water in basements. Had the authorities prioritized safety instead of comfort, New Orleans would not have looked like the destroyed town on the left, but like a city after a heavy rain on the right. Good morning, Baldwin. My name is Bailey Gulbash, and I'm here with Michael Magnotti. Today is Tuesday, March 5th, and I'm here with your morning announcements. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated for the rest of today's announcements. Today's impossible question is, on this day in 1971, what famous Led Zeppelin song was performed live for the first time? What song was it? Stay tuned to find out. The Special Olympics Club is sponsoring the Spread the Word inclusion campaign all this week. Stop by the tables outside the North and South Cafeteria during all lunch periods of the Baldwin or the Baldwin Bean Coffee Shop during first and second periods. We're asking you to take the pledge to avoid using your R word and also be accepting of people with all ability levels. The Baldwin Bean is closed today, but will reopen tomorrow. Attention all seniors. Applications are now available in the guidance office for the Gertrude Weinhardt Scholarship Fund. The scholarship is open to all senior students based on the following criteria. Academic achievements, financial need, likely academic success at the college or university, the concept of scholarship fund is to provide a secondary source of available funds to cover the cost of college. Please return the completed application to the guidance office. Application deadline is Friday, March 22nd, 2019. Now over to Michael for sports. Thanks, Bailey. Thank you to the students and staff who came out last night to support us in the playoffs. Unfortunately, the Baldwin Varsity hockey team lost 6-2 to two to USC. That's all for sports. Let's throw it back to the desk with Bailey. All juniors can turn in their Saris Candy Fundraiser form to Mrs. Neal in room 342 at any time. Orders are being accepted. Money due no later than today. Video club has been moved to Thursday. Thursday, today's holiday is Fat Tuesday. And the answer to today's impossible question of what famous song was performed live on this day is Stairway to Heaven. That's it for the morning announcements. Make it a great day or not, the choice is always yours.